The process of editing your movie or your content is often known as second directing and this is where you can intentionally change the mood with sound, music and color grading to you know further tell your story and oftentimes you can decide to take out some scenes to re-edit some scenes the pace there's a whole lot you can actually do in post-production and this is where the decision making actually comes alive this is the first time you will see all of your creative idea come alive into a masterpiece now stay with me the good thing is anybody can actually be an editor i mean you could be a colorist you could be a sound person all you need is a pretty beefy system that could actually undo it and um, an editing software basically so it depends on what you're doing in the post-production pipeline if you're just starting out it will be nice to watch other people work and also practice post-production involves adding sound music cutting the raw footage and the likes i mean the list actually goes on and on and oftentimes this requires professionals you know handling all of these things but in a situation whereby you are just the only one trying to like you know get into the post-production workflow you can learn more than one thing you can learn how to edit and also learn how to color and the fact that lots of moving parts are involved open communication is also very necessary 